Hello everyone, we already saw a way to create a contract with a variable that can only be modified by the owner of the contract. Now we will see a more professional way to achieve this using modifiers. So this is what we are going to replace. We are going to delete it and we are going to create a modifier. A modifier will be called only owner. This will mean that only the owner will be able to modify this contract. And here we will have the our if condition. If the owner is not equal to the message.sender, we will throw an error. Throw an error. Else, if our owner is indeed the message sender, then it means that he's able to modify it. So we will make this. This will make it to to do whatever it needs to do. For example, if we put it here in the set word, we put only owner. This will add this part of the, the code here. And if it's the owner, the else statement will execute and the word will be able to change to a new word. So we will create it and it's done. Hello world. We'll say hello Nicolas. We will change it. We successfully change the variable. We will see, hello Nicolas, ok, I will change the address, hello Nicolas from Chile, set word, and here is the error. So this way we can make it much more professional and this code will be reusable. So now we will be able to create more functions and adding only owner will make that function to only work with the owner of the contract. I will be much more professional, less code and more efficient. Bye, see you in the next one.